Hello friends in the series of BSC IPF. I welcome you all. We are here, here with the same topic which we have started in last video and the topic is last 12. If you are watching this video for a very first time then there is a separate video on the theory of uh, making a last will so don't miss out that video this video is also important because in this video we are coming up with one example that what are do's and don'ts of making the will and how we should avoid the clashes in the family this is one of the most important uh, topic on which about we are discussing usually it is not discussed uh, in detail in public domain because no one likes to talk about their death but yes this is very important because whatever we are earning we are doing it for our family so that if you feel that there should not be any clashes in next generation then we should be very much aware of how one can make the will and it is always important uh, you can always or we can always take the uh, suggestion and the help of lawyer because they can guide us in a better way but in this video we are looking uh, the general terms and conditions or general rules and regulations to make the will uh, with the help of which we can make a will and we can avoid the clashes in the next generation so yes this video is for both the parties uh, one who is uh, about to make a will and other who can be beneficiary of the will so beneficiary of will can be a very wrong uh, statement but uh, for a generation uh, who are doing execution of the will one can say so let us start this topic now what are the topic about which we have discussed it so far that we have seen that 25 percent of the all cases decided by court we get the right uh, in our samvitan by act uh, indian succession act 1925 that we can always challenge the will on what parts will can be challenged lack of due execution lack of knowledge approval fraud question uh, forgery etc what are the reason for lack of execution lack of knowledge how uh, how the how we can challenge if there is a fraud coercion or under influence if there is a forgery how we can cha how we can challenge if the element of suspension suspension suspicion is there how we can challenge lack of testamentary intention if there are lack of testamentary intentions uh, then also we can challenge lack of capacity of testator revocation of claims by family uh, we can always uh, we can always claim uh if if ever family feels that whatever whatever the will has been made uh, it is not correct uh, though there is no forgery though there is no uh, suspicion uh, situation though there is no multiple thumb impression but still a family feeling that this is not the correct distribution they can always challenge it in a court so uh, let us try to look at it uh, with an example that how we can how we can write a will uh, usually there is a mindset that uh, to make a will we always have to approach the lawyer no it is not like that we should always take a guidance of a lawyer but to make a will it is not mandatory to approach the lawyer on a simple white paper you can write it down and uh, you know whosoever is making a will called as a testator so the sign has to be there and the sign of two witnesses has to be there so this is one this is one example we have taken it uh, from an open source uh, so this is not the example which we have made it is it is available uh, on the internet so these are some do do's and these are some don'ts of uh, sample will uh, here we can see that uh, i suresh sinha born on 17 october so name has to be there date of birth has to be there father's name mother's name residing at means address has to be there pan number or aadhar card declare this to be my last will being made on date so this first paragraph is very much mandatory and very much important it has to be in the same format format can be changed slightly but these uh, language can be changed slightly but all these details should come in the very first paragraph then uh, i revoke all prior wills and codicils made on 14 and 11 and uh, 10th of october uh, so he says he is stating that if the will replaces the previous will the date of the earlier will uh, we need to mention that so when uh, see if there are two wills and uh, one is not aware about the other uh, then definitely it can be challenged but if i am the one who have made one will and I, now i'm changing my thoughts and changing my mind that uh, i should change my will so i need to always mention that i have made one will uh, two months back but now i want to change so i need to mention that i have made one or two wills dated on so and so date but now i want to change it so this has to be mentioned there then there should be a legal declaration stating that testator is healthy he should state that i am in a, i am in a good health and sound mind and is not writing this under coercion or pressure 
external force is not there we need to mention that it is very 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 much important or else one can always challenge the will then details are like this so this is this is how will can be started uh, the will should be preferably be returned by testator instead of being typed or printed because if there are, if the will is in handwriting then uh, the probability of uh, considering that will is correct is more because uh, it is easier to it, it is easier for the handwritten expert to prove automatically of the uh, of the will and it, it uh, and uh, should be in the language which can be understood by all so uh, so no need to get your will typed if you if you are just writing your will it is it is also enough what are the don'ts uh, if someone is saying that the bank accounts and the saving fixed should be gone to Vinit but who is Vinit the details of Vinit should be given properly complete details we need to mention in the will the relation should be mentioned well and don't leave any loan state and the list of details and the amount that you are, that you have at the time of writing will don't forget to keep the original copy of the will in a safe place so these are some important topics which one should understand that we we need to mention every each and small detail in a will in a proper way and secondly uh, we have to keep the will in a safe place uh, can copies of will uh, will can be there yes it can be there but original should be kept in a safe place so we are stopping here uh, if you want to know more about it or if you are having any questions do write to us our email address is mentioned in the description box and if you want to know more about some different topic please do let us know that also we will come back to you with that and thank you thank you very much for liking our session so far don't forget to write your name along with the mail address in the comment section and yes corona is not yet over please stay at home and be safe thank you very much stay tuned